Hello students, welcome back. In the previous video, we had learned how to add one digit numbers. In today's video, we will understand how to add two digit numbers. Look at an example here. Here we need to add 34 plus 25. As here two digits are there, we know their place values that is 1 and 10. So first we will write 1 and 10 and arrange these numbers according to their place values. In 34, 3 tens and 4 ones. So we will write 3 under 10 column and 4 under 1 column. Next, 25. So 2 tens and 5 ones. Here, we need to add these numbers according to their place value. And we will always start adding from one place. And never forget to write plus sign as we are doing addition. So, tell me students, what is 4 plus 5? 4 plus 5 is 9. Next, let's move to 10th column. What is 3 plus 2? 3 plus 2 is 5. So, the total of 34 and 25 is 59. When we add two numbers, the answer what we get is called as sum of total. So, 59 is the total of 34 plus 25. Look at another example at 44 plus 54. Let's write 10 and 1 and arrange the numbers according to their place value. So we'll write 4 under 10 column, 4 under 1 column. Next 54, 5 10, 4 1. So 5 under 10 column and 4 under 1 column. Will not forget to write the plus sign as we are doing. Addition. Now let's add from one place. What are the numbers at one place? 4 plus 4. So what is 4 plus 4 children? Yeah. 8. Next we'll move to 10th column. What is 4 plus 5? 4 plus 5 is 9. So the total of 44 plus 54 is 98. Look at another example here. Add 64 plus 37. Same way we will arrange these numbers according to their place values as 10 and 1. 64 means 6 tens, 4 1. 37, 3 tens and 7 1. Write the plus sign. Next. We will start adding from 1 column. So what is 7 plus 4? Yes, after 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So can we write 11 as it is under 1 column? No, we can't write 11 here. So in 11 there is 2 digits, right? That is 1 and 10. So we can't write 11 at 1 place only. Yes, so we will write one at one place and carry the other one to tenth place. Put one here and carry one to next column that is tenth column. So here we will carry one to tenth place. Next. Now don't forget to add the carried number when you are adding the tenth column. First add 6 plus 1. What is 6 plus 1? 7. And 7 plus 3 will be 10. So we will write here 10. So when we added 64 plus 37, the total is 101. So children, what did you understand here? When we add two numbers, if the total is more than 9, means if it is more than one digit number, we regroup the total as 10s and 1 and carry over the 10th digit to 10th column. And 
this type of addition is known as addition with regrouping or carry over when we add two numbers if the total is more than two digits then we will carry the number to next place value this type of addition is called addition with regrouping or carry over here when we solve this example when we added two numbers we got only one digit as the total so here it is addition without regrouping not with regrouping so when we add two numbers if the total will be more than one digit then only we will regroup the number look at another example here children add 28 plus 9 tens and ones here in 28 two tens and eight ones right and what about one it's only one there is no ten so we'll write ones under ones column next we will add what is 8 plus 9 8 plus 9 is 17 so can we write 17 as it is no it's a two digit number so we'll have to retain 7 here yes and carry one to tens column so we'll write 7 here and carry one to tens column as we carried one year yes we should not forget to add the carried number yes so 1 and 2 1 plus 2 is 3 if there is no number here means you can consider this place as zero any number added with zero means the answer will be the number itself so 1 plus 2 will be 3 right so when we added 28 plus 9 we got the answer as 37 so children hope you have understood how to add two digit numbers without regrouping means without carry over and with regrouping means with carry over thank you students keep supporting